Science Grade 5, Quarter 2, Module 1, Lesson 2. Describe the parts of the male and female reproductive system. After going through this module, you are expected to describe the function of the male and female reproductive system. Direction. Fill in the blanks with the letters of the correct answers. Be able to identify the function being described. The letters inside the boxes should form a word that refers to the process by which organisms produce offspring of their own kind. Write your answers in your activity notebook. 1. Produces sperm cells and secretes the male sex hormones. 2. Pathway where the egg travels from the ovary to the uterus. 3. Passageway for menstrual flow, passageway for sperm. 4. Passageway of fluid that neutralizes to the urethra, stores sperm. 5. Stores mature sperm and a site where the sperm cells gain the ability to move, which is necessary for fertilization. 6. Passageway for menstrual flow and baby to the outside. 7. Deposits sperm into the vagina. 8. Serves as the passageway for both sperm and urine has an opening that closes to pass one at a time. 9. Nurtured the fertilized egg. 10. The biological process by which new individual organisms are produced. Lesson 1. Describe the function of the male and female reproductive. Humans have many body systems. But a system involved in the production of offspring is called the reproductive system. The reproductive system has different parts which we have learned in the previous lesson. Direction. Describe the male and female reproductive system. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Male. 1. Penis. 2. Testes, 3. Urethra, 4. Vast difference. Female, 1. Vagina, 2. Ovary, 3. Uterus, 4. Cervix, 5. Fallopian tube. Unlike a woman, most of man's reproductive system is located outside of his body. These external structures include the penis and testes. Penis deposits sperm into the vagina. Testes produces sperm cells and secretes the male sex hormones. Urethra serves as the passageway for both sperm and urine. Has an opening that closes to pass one at a time. Vast difference. Passageway of fluid that neutralizes to the urethra, stores sperm. The female reproductive system is designed to carry out several functions. It produces egg cells necessary for reproduction. We have ovary, uterus, fallopian tube, cervix, and vagina. Ovary alternately produce the female sex cells and secretes the female hormones. Fallopian tube Pathway where the ova travels from the ovary to the uterus. Cervix Passageway for menstrual flow, passageway for sperm. Vagina Passageway for menstrual flow and baby to the outside. Uterus nurtured the fertilized egg. Direction. Unscramble the letters of the following to complete the concept. Write your answers in your activity notebook. 1. 
passageway for menstrual flow and baby to the outside. 2. Deposit sperm into the vagina. 3. Serves as the passageway for both sperm and urine. Has an opening that closes to pass one at a time. 4. Passageway for menstrual flow. Passageway for sperm. 5. Produces sperm cells and secretes the male sex hormones. Guided Activity 2 Direction Check the box whether the function is for male or female reproductive system. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Function Nurture the fertilized egg. Serves as the passageway for both sperm and urine has an opening that closes to pass one at a time. Deposit sperm into the vagina. Passageway for menstrual flow and baby to the outside. Pathway where the ova travels from the ovary to the uterus. Independent Activity 1 Direction Match the name of the organs, parts to its corresponding function. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Parts 1. Penis 2. Fallopian tube 3. Testes 4. Urethra Functions Bullet 1. Produces sperm cells and secretes the male sex hormones. Bullet 2. Deposits sperm into the vagina. Bullet 3 serves as the passageway for both sperm and urine, has an opening that closes to pass one at a time. Bullet 4. Passageway of fluid that neutralizes to the urethra, stores sperm. Parts 5. Vagina 6. Vast difference 7. Cervix 8. Ovary Functions Bullet 5 Alternately produce the female sex cells Bullet 6 Pathway where the ova travels from the ovary to the uterus Bullet 7 Passageway for menstrual flow Passageway for sperm Bullet 8 Passageway for menstrual flow and baby to the outside Independent Activity 2 Direction Using the following list, write the correct function from the male and female reproductive parts. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Male Reproductive Parts Penis Testes Urethra Vast Difference Female Reproductive Parts Vagina Ovary Uterus Fallopian Tube Cervix Reflect on your behavior. What happened? Not on task? Being disrespectful? Following direction? Pushing? Hitting? How are you feeling? Angry? Sad? Worried? Happy? What I want to know more. Direction. Match column A with column B. Write the letters only before each items. Write your answers in your activity notebook. Column A. 1. Where fertilization takes place. 2. Holds the testes in place. 3. Passageway of a baby about to be born. 4. Stores matured sperm. 5. Place where fertilized egg develops. 6. The female sex organ. 7. Male organ for reproduction. 8. The male reproductive cell. 9. Produces sperm. 10. The female reproductive cell. Column B. 
A. Ovary B. Sperm C. Testis D. Egg E. Epididymis F. Scrotum G. Fallopian tube H. Penis I. Uterus J. Vagina Direction Read the following story and fill in the blocks using the words provided below. Penis, vas deferens, scrotum, semen, sperm cells, ejaculation, seminal vesicle, urine, testicles, erection, urethra. The journey of a sperm. Once upon a time, there was a pair of blank. They were held in a special sack called the blanc. This sack could hold the testicles close to the body to keep them warm or to let them hang away from the body to keep them cool. The testicles made special reproductive cells called blanc. Once these cells were made, they would wait to be released from the testicles. Sometimes, they would wait so long that they dissolved. Other times, they would be released from the testicles, make a journey through the male reproductive system, and leave the male's body. When the sperm leave the penis, it is called blank. On the day in question, it just so happened that the sperm got to be released from the body. First, the blank become larger, longer, and firmer until it stuck out from the body. When the penis gets this way, it is called and blanc. Erections are normal process of growing up and can happen for physical reasons or because of sexual arousal. Then, the sperm traveled up the blanc. Along the way, it mixed with prostatic fluid from the prostate gland and seminal fluid, which was made in the blanc. Once these fluids mixed, they decided to call themselves blank. Together, they traveled from the vast difference into a tube called the blank. There are two branches to the urethra, one from the bladder and the other from the vast difference. When the penis is ready to release semen, a valve blocks off the branch to the bladder, so blank cannot escape. Only one of the two fluids can pass through the urethra at a time. By this time, the semen was almost at the end of the journey. After traveling through the vast difference and the urethra, the semen was released from the penis in a process called blank. The erection went away and the penis became smaller and softer.